Hello everybody, this is Tony Cepeda. Today we're going to go over the computer system for a 75 ton RT crane, otherwise known as an LMI. Okay, so obviously you got your measurements, all these buttons. I'm going to go over each and everything and what they do, I'm trying to make it as fast as possible. So let's start. In the screen, it's showing times one. Your times one is your reaving, and that's because I'm using my whip line. So I only have one part line. This little symbol indicates that I'm using the second telescopic mode. The Donald Crane has two modes, first and second. The first one allows your second boom to come out first, then your third and fourth. The second mode allows your third and fourth sections to come out first so I'm in my second I'm in the second mode and I have my third and fourth out first second coming last I have 114 feet of stick out from the base of the boom to the tip I have a 66 degree angle and I have a 44.2 radius from where I'm at to the hooks those hooks right there okay on this Tadano crane, we're using a we're using a 12,000 pound counterweight. I have the outriggers fully extended. The weight I have on the boom tip is 2,000 pounds and some change. What I'm good for is 12,000 pounds. So that means I have 10,000 pounds that I can lift. Okay, This is a diagram basically showing where my boom is at right now. It's about 1 o'clock. I'm going to show you right now. So my boom is right there. That's 114 feet of boom. The angle within here is 66 degrees from the base to the boom tip is 114 feet from the whip line hooks back to me is 44 foot radius okay so we got the main block we got the whip line we got the fourth section, the third section, and the second section. In this mode, the third and fourth come out first, the second being the last. Okay. Now what these buttons are up here, this is to silence your alarms. This one right here is to change your weight display. These indicators right here on this Tadano crane allow you to set limitations, either increasing or reducing your uh, boom angle, your swing radius, your extension of your boom, and your retraction of your boom. So with this crane, the features that it allows you to do is set, set your limitations if you don't want to swing too far, if you don't want to boom too high or too low, you know, if you don't want to extend too far, too far or too short, it gives you those options. This right here is for your main winch. This allows you a visual of how fast you're going, how slow you're going, up and down. Let me show you. So it's giving you a visual of how fast you're going just in case you need a visual to see because it's too far away. This yellow indicates that you're getting within close range of your maximum lift capacity. This is telling you that you've reached that and this, is, this one's completely cutting you out, telling you you can no longer lift anything. This button right here is for these functions right here to set up your limitations 
for your boon, for your swing, and for your extension and retraction. This one's to set up your counterweight if you want to change it out because it is adjustable. You can change it out to a heavier one or a lighter one. This one is for your reading. We're on our whip line, which is your second drum. It's only good for one line. If you want to switch it to your main line, you gotta go there at your first drum. Right now we currently have it set up to four parts of line. You can change that, more or less. We only have four parts of line on there. This right here is if you wanna set up for your rooster sheet, which we have set up for the whip line, or to move back to your main line, or to move to your jib, longer jib, and your bigger jib, which are offsets that it's able to do. Let's go back to where we're set, okay? And then this one right here, this button is for your outriggers. That's showing, the computer already knows that it's fully extended, so it's showing that. That blinking tires is because you can creep or move slowly with this crane as well as make a, a pick and carry it. That's a stationary sign showing that you're gonna be picking on the tires, but stationary, not moving or traveling. So let's go back to where we're at. And that's it. That's the LMI system for the 75 ton Tadano crane, rough terrain. If any questions, please get back to me and let me know. Thank you.